My name's Audrey Snow, here with Mississippi Mike Wolf. We're gonna play a couple originals and some covers for you today. We're gonna start with a Gillian Welch tune called Everything is Free. Oh, also, let's do this. This is what they do when you play a KEXP. What's that? Yeah, a lead guitar player goes like this. One, two, three. <laughs> Everything is free now That's what they say And everything I've ever done Gotta give it away Someone hit the big score They figured it out We're gonna do it anyway Even if it doesn't pay I could get a tip jar and guess at the car and try to make a little change down at the bar. Or I could get a street job, I've done it before, and I never minded working hard, it's who I'm working Everything is free now That's what they say And everything I've ever done Gotta give it away Someone hit the big score They figured it out We're gonna do it anyway Even if it doesn't pay Song. And I don't need to run around I'll just stay at home I'll sing a little love song To my lover, myself If there's something that you want to hear You can sing it yourself Cause everything is free now that's what I said, and no one's got to listen to the words in my head. Someone hit the big score, I figured it out, I'm gonna do it anyway, even if it doesn't Think about that. <laughs> yeah. Well, Gillian Welch is one of my favorite songwriters, and um, 
I started playing that song a couple years ago, so it's one of the ones I know. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, the next what one. What is the story? That song is about Spotify? Yeah, everything is free now. Um, I guess it's about streaming services and how musicians you know, get paid pennies for putting their music out there and everyone gets I to listen to it for free. Yeah. When everything is free now. Of course. I'm on board with And we're going to do it anyway, even if it doesn't pay. Yeah. So, and I wonder what year they wrote that song. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We're going to do a, a John Prine song now. John Prine, my other favorite. This is called uh, Sound of the Speed of Loneliness.
I was supposed to play a John Prine tribute. I mean, he was still alive. And then it got canceled for COVID. And the day that it was supposed to happen was the day he died. Mm. It was going to be at the ice house in Minneapolis. Wow. Yeah, 2020. That's when I started playing music more often. Mike encouraged me, and John Prine's songs are the first songs I started playing just because they're they're simple chord wise, but like beautiful lyrics, obviously. The first song I shared on the internet, <laughs> John Prine. But anyway, <laughs> I'm and gonna sing gonna a do one you wrote. I wrote <laughs> since then. song I wrote a couple years ago. One of the first songs I wrote. One of the only songs I wrote so far. <laughs> <laughs> Working on it. Okay. And of course I'll have to play Bob Dylan tune. 
That's what got me to playing guitar, probably. I am so happy to be here on Highway 61. Yeah, we're on the highway. We are in Bob Dylan land. Bob Dylan land. <laughs> If you're traveling to the North Country Fair Where the winds hit heavy on the borderline well, See for me to one who lives there For she once was a true love of mine And if you're going where the snow flakes fall, the rivers freeze and the summer ends. See for me, she wears a coat so warm to keep her from the howling winds. See for me that her hair's hanging down, that it rolls and flows all down her breast. See for me that her hair's hanging down, that's the way I remember her best. Now I wonder. Does she think of me at all? Many nights I hope and pray Oh, in the darkness of my nights And in the brightness of If you're traveling to the North Country Fair Where the winds hit heavy on the borderline well, See for me to one who lives there For she once was a true love of mine For she once was a true love of mine For she once was A true love of mine <laughs> All right. Bobby D <laughs> <laughs> How did you think Bobby that? D Is that alright? Is that alright? <laughs> yeah. This next song is this another song I wrote called Baby Mine about my my daughter, Lena. Hi, Lena, if you're watching.
And if I lost her in a crowd, I would search 10,000 miles. Baby mine, baby mine. She's got her daddy smile, she's got my hoots and howls. Baby mine, baby mine. Baby mine, baby mine With her heart on her sleeve She could never love me more Baby mine, baby mine Baby mine, baby mine And what did I even do before she came along? Baby mine, baby mine Now my years are too short And my days are too long Baby mine, baby mine Baby mine, baby mine if I lost her in a crowd, I could search 10,000 miles. Baby mine, baby mine. She's got her daddy smiles, she's got my hoots and howls. Baby mine, baby mine. Well, I, I do want to say thank you to, to, Aldrich? to, to Bo, well, oh. to you. I want to say <laughs> thank you to Bosch and to John and to Aldri for hosting us here. And, and to thank you guys for coming out here and, and yeah, this is super cool. Yeah. Um, we're very lucky. Duluth is an incredible, uh, two arbors. I know you guys aren't. But uh, this whole area is amazing. And we're very lucky. We're very, very lucky. Mm -hmm. All right, this is a song called Book of Love. By? By the Magnetic Fields. From? San Francisco. New York. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> the album 69 Love Songs. Oh, from 69 songs. Love Songs. <laughs> it's, it's good. Check it out. Nobody can lift the damn thing It's full of charts and facts and figures And instructions for dancing But I, oh I love it when you read to me You, you could read me The book of love is full of music In fact, that's where music comes from And some of it is transcendental 
some of it is really dumb but I oh I love it when you sing to me do you you could sing me The book of love is long and boring and It was written long ago It's full of flowers and heart-shaped boxes And all the things we're too young to know But I, oh I love it when you give me things you Ought to give me wedding rings I, oh I love it when you give me things You, you ought to give me wedding rings Alright, that's that. That's all we have for today. <laughs> 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 Do you have any questions for me, Mike? Where are you from? <laughs> I'm from Lesur, Minnesota, southern Minnesota, corn country. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Is there any giants that are from there? <laughs> the home of the Jolly Green Giant. Yes. <laughs> yes. It's a big inspiration for me. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Hey. So, how long have you been playing? Well, I, <laughs> I learned to play guitar in high school, um, but I started playing out just a couple years ago, um, kind of during the pandemic, I guess, the when people were sharing things online, I started sharing things on Facebook, um, did a couple YouTube shows, um, and that was my first live, live performances. Yeah. And you also do a variety show occasionally. Yes, we do an uh, Elderly Snow variety show, and that will be at Earth Rider, um, Earth Rider Festival Field this summer. We still need to select a date, but it's uh, a variety show with games, audience sing-alongs. Um, then we have a talent section, so keep an eye out for that um, on the Cedar Lounge's social media or perfect Duluth day it'll be in there and you your social media is snow fancy snow's fancy snow's on fancy. instagram mm -hmm. i got it wrong but because you also make hot sauce under that name i do have a hot sauce a small hot sauce business snow's fancy so keep an eye out for Can that you spell it please s-n-o-w-s-f-a-n-c-y <laughs> dot com, dot com. Not yet. I don't have a website yet, but. Um, yeah, an interesting connection to Duluth. Uh, the owner of Amazing Grace, Marcy Stoike, is the woman who taught me how to play guitar originally um, in Lesur. And then she moved up here to marry Chip, who was the original owner, and helped her on the Grace for a while. So uh, bittersweet that they recently shut down. They were a really awesome part of the community, so. And we, we, we mentioned it earlier, but Squash Fest, your co-director. I'm the co-director, yes, of Squash Fest. It's um, September 15th and 16th in Foxborough, Wisconsin. It's about 30 miles south of Superior. Um, squashfest.org. And we also have an Instagram and a Facebook page for Squash Fest as well. So stay tuned. We're going to release the, the lineup in the next couple weeks. Well, I want to thank Mississippi Mike for joining me today. <laughs> it's always fun to have you play along. <laughs> well, I want to, We're too loud. I want to thank you guys um, for coming and being so supportive of our... You, you can't see them, they're behind the camera, but uh, K 
Kim and Jose, they really are a big part of our of our scene. Yeah. There she is. Enjoy it. <laughs> oh, and this is where you give us a check. Yeah. yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> check. Um, yeah. So this is this that one. That's how we'll end the video with you. Thank you for listening to Two Harbors Community Radio. Hey, this is Eldry Snow, and you've been listening to KTWHLP 99.5 FM, Two Harbors, Minnesota, and streaming online at KTWH.org. Pretty good. <laughs> <laughs>